My life has changed so dramatically that if you were to see me a year ago, I probably wouldn't even look alike. <laughs> I grew up in Chicago in a section of the city called Logan Square. My mom did not have any education. She worked in factory jobs. She lived with welfare to primarily feed us. We were absolutely hungry all the time. You know, we would eat until the money ran out and then we wouldn't eat. At the time that I got my associate's degree, I was in prison. I had uh, a lot of trouble finding work because primarily of my background. Chicago's Community Kitchens is a two-part mission. A part of our mission is a food service job training program. It's also a production kitchen where we produce anywhere from 1,400 to 2,500 meals a day for children in after school programs throughout Cook County. The students of Chicago's Community Kitchens are residents of Cook County. They are unemployed and underemployed adults seeking a job in the food service industry. The program is very intense. They teach good cutting skills. They teach uh, how to follow a recipe and the temperatures of food, how to store food, how to make food safe to eat. And we're gonna lower the egg out of the bowl into the water. Plus, uh, they teach you, you know, people skills, how to interact in that environment, how to deal with bosses, how to look for a job, how to write a resume. And then they put you in an environment where you can actually utilize those skills when you intern. The internship is an opportunity for the employer to test out a potential employee. Is this about the right thickness? I think it's like this. All right, cool. Thanks, man. Mindy Siegel's Hot Chocolate is the place where I intern. Primarily, Mindy is a pastry master, so hot chocolate is the best place in the city to get desserts. When my internship completed, the chef there that was, the boss's name is Chris Gibbons, he said, I want to give you an opportunity to work at Hot Chocolate, and I was ecstatic, to say the least. The Greater Chicago Food Depository's mission is to end hunger in our community. By our students finding employment and maintaining employment, they're able to break the cycle of poverty that is oftentimes generational within their own families. I went from having no money, being completely poor, begging my friends. I had nothing, and I felt like I was nothing. So CCK provided me uh, an actual career. I mean, I have a job. I consider myself a chef for all intents and purposes. I have a car, I'm moving into my own place. I mean, I, I'm a new person.